Always the Lady Monarchs will lace up and hit the court, but today they're fighting for one member of their team, Sarah Jones. She's a volunteer for the Lady Monarchs. She's been fighting cancer for 11 years, but this year is different. Here's 10 on your side's Ali Lucia with a look at Sarah's impact, which goes well beyond the court. Hi. Hi, Sarah. What's going on? Seeing her out on the court. Oh, how are you? I'm Can't good. See you. Hearing her interact with the players. What's up, Mary Buckets? You wouldn't know she's coaching basketball for the first time. Good shot. You wouldn't know some days Sarah Jones struggles to get out of bed. Instead of making myself feel so much pressure, I try to um, give myself permission that if I don't want to get out of bed one day, that that's okay. You wouldn't know she's terminally ill. Yeah, I think everything's good. Yeah, just, you know, just still tired from radiation, but that'll take a couple weeks, you know, because it still lasts, like, after, you're, after you do radiation, it still lasts like you're going to it for two weeks. Breast cancer is back for the third time, only this time it isn't going away. And then in March of 2010, it was diagnosed again, but this time was kind of a game changer. It was diagnosed as terminal stage four metastatic breast cancer. So it is actually breast cancer, but it's gone to the bones. But instead of letting the cancer beat her, she's beating it the only way she knows how. I love basketball and to, and, and to be able to actually be a part of it every day and to, uh, I feel like I'm a player, you know, I mean, it's, it's just, it's exciting. It's going SG. How you doing, girl? No, Sarah doesn't have a starting job. But she does have a big role on first year old Dominion head coach Karen Barefoot's staff. Uh, you know, she gives us so much energy and she sparks our team. The two met in a game of pickup basketball. And we just met just playing, you know, pickup in a summer league. And we just, you know, hey, you playing basketball this weekend? Hey, Barefoot. And friends, they have stayed. Where's, where's Tia? Throughout Sarah's long 11-year battle. Oh, really? Okay. Our souls were meant to, to be friends. You guys did awesome the other day. She may be a volunteer, but it's tough to tell who's benefiting more, Sarah or the Lady Monarch. Like, when I go through things, I'm like, okay, well, Sarah's going through this, so therefore, what I'm going through means nothing. All right, these Lady Monarchs will have a little extra motivation for the hoops for the Cure game against BCU. It's just amazing how she comes every single day with such a positive attitude, such a positive outlook on life. Like, she's just living, and, like, it's so contagious. I mean, what, do you, what do you think about your game now? Like, I mean, I think you're really stepping up your leadership role. Do you feel like that? And a great day to honor one woman on the court whose smile has done so much for so many this season.